you guys, it's real. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm hanging out with my brother from another mother. It is Matt Pat. It's been too long. <laughs> I know. I know. This is great. I it's, know. It's good to be here. I'm glad that I dressed so I match and blend into your kitchen. You really do. I'm like a chameleon I mean, look now. Look at this. It's kind of like kitchen camo. Can you even and see me? Look at this. I am dressed as... Yeah. Chester Cheetah. Oh, is that why? I thought you were like memorializing the Cheetah Girls. Oh, also good. Matt's just ahead. <laughs> Look, you know, it's like it's like wearing green on a green screen. Hey, Ro, I'm the floating head of Matt Pat. Welcome to content. <laughs> I, I, I love this, Matt. This is my guilty pleasure. Is that your flaming hot secret? It's my flaming hot secret that I love flaming hot Cheetos. <laughs> Great. Okay. They're good. Um, I literally thought I could eat these on anything. So today we are gonna be trying like seven different Flamin' Hot Cheeto foods from like restaurants and stores in LA. So we'll give it a does Done. it work or does it don't work? Okay. Wait, that's not a sentence. It, 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 it worked. Work. You know does what? It Did it end with a period? Yes. Then it was a sentence. Yeah! That's Matt Pat think for you. Yeah, and if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Or if you like flaming hot Cheetos, give this video a thumbs up. Click subscribe, ring the bell to receive notifications every time I post a new video because we're going to be doing some silly things this year. Also, go like Matt's oh, channel. Wow. Already? Go subscribe. Thank you. I'm putting links down below. He's got a channel, I do. Game Theory, and there's another one. And he's got all of his videos. And I'll also, put him, I'm, yeah, I'm putting all of it. He's fancy, okay? He runs more than one cheat. I can't do that. Let's pop into some flaming Hot Cheetos. Yeah, we're going to start with the taste test. Get the baseline. So we know what it tastes like. Mike behind the camera was like, be careful, the bags are going to be noisy. To that I say. <laughs> Apologies, headphone users. Love you, Mike. Uh, yeah. <laughs> is this gonna be noisy too? Mm. Great. Delicious. Just the right amount. Fantastic. Of spice. It really hits you right at the end. Mm. It does. It's really hot, and I love it. And it's almost like, oh, we should wait a minute, or we should have another one. Oh, so good. <laughs> Do we really need to get to all the other foods? Because I could just sit here and eat this whole bag. Great. Yes. Let's start with the first food. The first. Flaming Hot Cheeto dish is from Smile Hot Dog. These are from Little Tokyo here in LA. Great, this looks incredible. It's a corn dog, but it's fried oh. in like, you know, the corn batter, but it also, the batter has Flaming Hot Cheetos and they give you some in the little dish. I was, I was gonna there. say, I feel I feel like I got a little couple worms on the top of I know, my- they're like stuck on here. Little, little bagglers right All right, let's right cheers and let's try them. Let's do it. And we're gonna test, Again. does this work? Okay, does it work? Mm. Hmm. Hmm. Solid hot dog. I don't really taste the flaming hot. I was gonna say not particularly hot or flaming. It's red, so you think this thing would be chocked with seasoning and just mm -hmm. be like super flavorful, right. but it's not. It really just tastes like a corn dog. No, with it's like a. It's just of spice. Yeah, just a corn dog. As I I bite through the individual little stragglers on yeah, there. Yeah, let me see here. A little stale. Oh my gosh! Yeah. It is stale. It is stale. I honestly think. That had they used nice fresh flaming hot Cheetos, hashtag not sponsored. Yeah. The flavor would pop, but uh exactly. when you're using yesterday's three days ago, flaming hot, no. Except no substitutes. Yeah. Did it work? I give it a floppy hot dog. I say no. It's I wanted to really taste it. As a hot dog, delicious. It's but creative. as a flaming hot dog, flaming hot hot dog, dog. no. No. Let's do let's do our next dish. Mm-hmm. Do the rave transition. <laughs> okay, this next dish is from the valley. Okay. And it's flaming hot Cheeto sushi. No. <laughs> No! Yes. Oh, I don't know. It looks I... like California rolls, but they've sprinkled hot Cheeto, oh, like crumbles all this. over the top. There's no way! Or is it, oh, are they spicy tuna? Wait, Molly, what kind? <laughs> I mean, in concept, it makes sense, right? If it's, because spiciness is an inherent part of your sushi roll. Yeah, a little wasabi or like a, like a, like a hot spicy tuna right? it's, roll. It's like the little masago, except it's Cheeto. Mas, machito. 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 Okay, here we go. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. It's a spicy tuna roll. Yeah, it's a spicy tuna roll. That's it. I don't taste it. Yep, it is. Maybe what we're starting to realize here very early on in this process, Flamin' Hot Cheetos, well delicious. Yeah. Doesn't have a flavor that stands up to, oh, I'm feeling a little warm on the back end. Whew, hot. But that's, but that's not so much Flamin' Hot Cheeto hot, it's just like, 
hot. Wasabi I think, hot. I think they uh, that might have had a lot of wasabi on there mm. because that's yeah. really hot. That built that built toward the the back end. Oh, it's just hanging out back there. Ooh. Great. What I was about to say <laughs> though was maybe the flaming hot Cheeto can't really stand up to the stronger flavors of say a hot dog or a sushi. I feel so bad because I feel like I just surprised an episode of Hot Ones on you. It's great. Okay, this is a hot Cheeto ponzu and spicy mayo, and I will say really spicy. Yes. Really, really, really spicy, and I don't really taste specific hot Cheeto taste, like just that singular taste, but mm -hmm. I think it's because it's sushi. There's so many other flavors going on, but I would say it's bad. That's that's exactly what I was gonna say. I think the the essence here is, the, the roll is delicious. Mm -hmm. It's hard to screw up sushi unless you're pulling out really old fish, <laughs> gotta say. But what you're missing is the essence of the hot Cheeto. Like, I like mm -hmm. the snap of the hot Cheeto, mm -hmm. and I like that little delayed burn, whereas this is more of just a traditional, like, wasabi, yeah. spicy mayo burn. But it tastes good, especially if you like spicy sushi. Going back for a second. Yum. Mm -hmm. See, the fact that you're doing that, I think this gets a thumbs up. Even though we don't get all that distinct taste, it's still good, it goes with it. Here's my rating. Sushi, thumbs up. Mm -hmm. Flaming hot sushi, a schmedium? Yeah, you shmedium. Get a shmedium. Shmedium. If you want a flaming hot Cheeto, it pairs well. Sushi should not be your first choice. No. All Go right. figure. I got another one. I got another Rave one. Rave transition. <laughs> so this dish took some love. Molly had to call four places. It's from Amici, and it is a cheese pizza with flaming hot Cheetos baked on top. I, I b baked. I feel like yes. it's a very generous term for what I Look see it. on this You're pizza like... plate. Like it's literally. I feel like we we <laughs> called and we're like, hey, do you do flaming hot Cheetos pizza? And they're like, uh, sure we do. And they just made a pizza. <laughs> Drop by like the 7 Eleven, got it a bag. Is. Just do it. Yeah, we do it. We do it here. Boom. <laughs> It'll cost you an extra five bucks. I'm like, what? <laughs> what? I, it's a weird. racket. They're running a racket on us. I'm also really concerned about just the pizza. It's like, this is. It's a little floppy. It's, it's a little floppy pizza. All right, let's try it. Let's do it. Does, here we go. Does it go? <laughs> does it go? Oh, God. That was terrible. I'm sorry. Again, they're using stale Cheetos. Oh. Stop using stale Cheetos. You think it's stale because it's been in the oven and then it dried out. I don't care. It's just, I don't care. In I'm the just moisture. throwing them at the camera because that's how I feel Put about them. Put some fresh ones on there. I love pizza. Give it a chance. Put some fresh ones. Here. Put some fresh ones on there. Get rid of theirs. Here. I. And we'll do it fresh. Hello, I work at Amici. Oh, you want my flaming out Cheeto pizza? Here we go. Let me make it all fresh out of the oven just for you. That's better. See, there it is. And I like, I... That's better. See, and it's crunch. Mmm. That's texture. I like that. That was great. I like that. You have to put more Cheetos on top. Fresh Cheetos on top. Yeah. If There's you, a crunch. Yeah, if you order them just without it, you're going to be disappointed. L.A. is so full. This is my rant about L.A. Can I do you this? Can I do my rant about L.A.? Please Can I get no. real for a second? L.A. is so full of these places that are like, oh, we need to be different and new and exciting and trendy. trendy. And, and they produce such garbage so much of the time. Guys. Give us the good just stuff. Just give us the good stuff. Like, don't come out with something new and trendy if it's not good. Sure, you, you got my business for one pie of you know, pizza. <laughs> pie of pizza. But you're not getting my return business. They could have crunched it and sprinkled that on the top too. They could have done any number of things. That would have been really nice. Mm -hmm. <gasps> what if they made a tomato sauce with crunched Cheetos See, in the tomato sauce, too, because then it would have a hint of that in the tomato sauce and topped with it. See, that would have been This is great. why you have a cooking channel, Ro. It, yeah, because you think of these things, the details This matter. is the stuff that these places need. Uh -huh. Rosanna Pancino. Yes, what? Can we do like a Kitchen Nightmares-esque video with you going to these places and being like, hold up. Wow. I bought your flaming Hot Cheeto and pizza and I was disappointed. A, we gave it a thumbs down. We gave it a thumbs down, but, but... But it could have been this. But I, Rosanna Pancino, are gonna... F recipe gonna fixers. Recipe fixers. Recipe fixers. Food fixers. Ooh, the food fix. That's ours. YouTube That's original. Our new show, Food Fixers. Watch out, YTO team. Yeah. We're coming at you. I'm, I'm attaching myself to this show, by the way. We're, we're gonna do it. I, I don't know what Who role I have in this. make us co-hosts? Right. That's my question. It seems are, insane are people to not do crazy? That. Are people crazy? Crazy. You're the one with the actual knowledge and expertise and good ideas, and I'm the one who just sits there and eats everything. You're really smart. 
Great. I love I it. I know food. Thanks for finding a place for it. And you're really smart. <laughs> Great. That's it. So when I can't say stuff and you yeah. know what I'm thinking, right. then, we, then we can tell, then we can communicate. I'll be your sassy voice. Yes. Yes. Call Leave it in me. the comments. Tell them. Food fixers. F food fixers. We'll fix you. Come in, food. Come into a ad supported streaming service near you. Transition. <laughs> so on our plates, there are three dishes. They're all from Chips and chick. Chips in chicks or chip chips and chicks. It's in with, but in with a thing. Like so chip like and dale. And. Chip and dale. Ch -ch -ch chip yeah. and dale. Rescue chip Rangers. and chick. And we've got Ch -ch 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 chip fries, and chicks. Chicken tenders, and this is this a sandwich? I, I think that's a grilled no. cheese with hot Cheeto chicken on it. Is it a grilled All cheese or is it a melt? Oh, is there a difference? Um, What's no. the difference? Wow. It's a whole argument online because. There's a subreddit that's called Grilled Cheese, yeah. and it's just pictures of grilled cheese sandwiches. Sure. But anytime someone posts a picture of a grilled cheese with anything in it other than just cheese, it's, considered a it's like a whole- No way! Thing. I had no idea! I, Hashtag drama! Hashtag debates. Yes. Happening here, food debates. I feel like a grilled cheese comes with a very specific connotation. It's bread yeah. and cheese, grilled. and it has been grilled. Yes. N nothing else. Everything yes. else is just a sandwich with cheese, yeah. right? Yes. Is that controversial? Let us know in the comments down below. I don't below. think that that's a controversy. I think that's a fact. Yeah. Food facts. Food facts. I think so. Welcome, welcome to Rosanna Pansino's channel. Welcome to another show we're making. Food, Food facts. facts. I love it. Wouldn't that be good? Let's do it. YTO, make it happen. Yes, yes, right yes. Here. Boom. Yeah. I threw this hand because I'm still holding food and it's, it's flying everywhere. It's I'm trying these. That's, that is a French fry. I'm that is usually what's known as a French fry. <laughs> French fries first, and it has like Cheeto crumbs and a little chicken on top and a little cheese. It's kind of like when you get loaded cheese fries. Yeah, I was gonna say it's a loaded cheese They're fry. Loaded. Right? Mm. On one hand, I, I recognize that me using my hands for this is probably a bad idea because they are loaded that. fries. But at the same time, I don't want to eat fries with a fork. That's another hot take, a flaming hot take. Am I? Did I just commit a food sin? No, you're fine. I did, didn't I? No, I think for loaded fries. It's totally okay to, work, to use a, a fork. Slap some devil horns on me, because I just I just committed a food sin. I just ate French fries with a food fork. Sins. Another, food sins! Another sins. show! Our third show coming up. Third now. show! It's where we do things you're not supposed to. Mm. Very naughty. We could find the worst food offenses we could ever do and do them. I love it. Double dipping. Oh! That's like people are really sensitive about double dipping. We should test food how sin. much bacteria Gets oh. into it when you double dip. Oh no! I'll oh, cry. food I'll sin! Cry. Food sin! No, food, food sin. sin! Food sin! That's great. I love or it. Or like when you drop food on the floor, but it's not five, five second rule. It's not a five second rule. What if it's like you leave it there for like a minute? Whoa! And you find it later. What is your maximum amount of time that the food can drop on the floor? And then people are food looking sin. at you like you just ate that off the floor. And you're like, yeah, but I have the science to prove that didn't matter. Food Boom! Sin. Uh. <laughs> Here's my pickiness. I want the spicy Cheeto flakes to be in the cheese. Yep. And then drizzled over the fries. Yep. But they're not. It's, 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 it's literally just crumbled on top. It's just a fry, mm -hmm. and then it's just thrown on top, and it's really just a part of the chicken. So yeah, I was gonna say, really what I'm noticing, even though this is three dishes of Flamin' Hot Cheeto, it's really just one dish repurposed three times. It's the chicken yeah. is chopped up in the fries. Here's just a large piece of chicken. Breaded. Which, with... which they call the tender, which is, this is no tender. This no. is not a tender, Huge. my friend. And then this is the third one, which is literally the same chicken, just on a bread with melty cheese. Really, this isn't flaming hot Cheetos. It's flaming hot chicken three ways. Pretty much, it's all the chicken. It does give a little heat to the chicken, which I like. Which I like. Mm -hmm. It's a bit like a Nashville hot chicken. Ooh, yes. Mm -hmm. It's fine. I, it's like it's all right. It is solidly in the middle. If you're gonna do it, I recommend getting just like. The chicken solo. Chicken, it's great. It's breaded in it. You can like taste it all over. I'm feeling all the spices in my mouth. I love, I love the chicken. Right. The fries a little disappointing, and the sandwich disappointing. Right. I, I was, sandwich, I was hoping for more. Fries, but the chicken itself. There it is. Boom. Transition. <laughs> last hot. Wait, flaming hot Cheeto. Yes, <laughs> our last flaming hot Cheeto dish. Now this is very bougie. This is hard to get. Yeah. Yes, this is delivery only. So oh. you have to order it, and you have to show up and wait. That's such an LA it's thing. It's from a place called Mac'd, or it's Mac D. It's mac and cheese with Cheetos on top. Because you know, 
mac and cheese is totally the dish that you want as a delivery only item. Oh, of course. That, that seems so random to me. Okay, so the Why? one thing I have to say sorry, and I tried so hard to get this. Okay. But there's actually a bagel place, like a bagel truck yeah. that goes around LA, and they have a flaming hot Cheeto bagel, but they post on their Instagram where yeah. they're gonna be on different days. Molly chased them around all day. Molly. Chased them around all day. She went to everywhere they were supposed to be. She called, how many, you emailed, couldn't find You couldn't them. find? We couldn't find them. Even on their Twitter, because a lot of times those places do like, oh, Twitter, here's our next location. Yeah. Nothing? Even the two locations they posted for mm -hmm. their yeah. Thursday schedule, mm -hmm. they were not at either. Nothing? No. no. So Food trucks, you got, we, be more responsible. You guys only see, us sitting here trying all the food, but we should have filmed us running around like chickens with their heads cut off, just like, oh, la, 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 la. oh, wait, I shouldn't say that, it's kind of dark. Can we do that again? Oh, I hit the microphone, sorry, Mike. All right, let's try it, ready? Mm -hmm. Cheesy. Cheesy. Where's the hot? Non-existent. It just swallows it. Yep. Yep, I think what's happening in this one, honestly, what? is that the dairy Whoa, of the cheese. back of my throat. Oh, did you really get some? Really hot. Really? But I'm not tasting any of the flavor. It's just like hot in the back of my throat. Let me, let me do another you, one. You had the same thing with the sushi. Though. Mm -hmm. I did. It's sitting here, but I don't taste anything. It's a little bit spicier than it normally would be, but I think what you're getting here is the dairy of the cheese is covering up the spice. And so it's deadening the spice. That's what it is. I think that's what I was it is. like, look at all the seasoning. How can I not be tasting it? It's a right. little spicier, but I, I don't it taste it. It's the dairy. That must be it. You know how when you eat a spicy food, you're supposed to have like milk afterward and not like water because the, the milk helps, take helps away deaden the, the spice. The taste. I think here, because you're doing, dealing with a dairy product, and a very heavy dairy product, which is cheese, it's counteracting the spice. And so you end up with just like a warm mac and cheese. We need a vegan mac and cheese. That's to make it happen, that's true. We need I a want, vegan mac and cheese. I wonder how that would maybe work. Maybe like a nut nut cheese. That does it for all of my flaming hot Cheeto foods that we tried today. And only a couple got our thumbs up. So full, like this works together. Yep, we like the sushi. Mm-hmm. And we like the chicken yes. as a part of that plate. And I can taste it and right. it's good together. But honestly, I think what all of them miss, and I think this is the thing that got me to kind of just have a general negative towards a lot of these, is all of them are missing that little snap texture at the beginning. No. Like, you eat a Cheeto, not just for the flavor, but for like the cheesy crunch of mm -hmm, it all, right? Mm -hmm. And all of them, when you grind it up, you lose that. And I so, agree. Especially on the pizza. Man, I go back to these, and these are so much better. I know, I these love These are pizza. so good relative to everything else. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Matt, thank you for coming over. Oh my gosh, And anytime. you were so brave. Are you? He's wearing white. And we're eating flaming hot Cheetos. Okay, so please go to his channel and give him all of the love and thumbs <laughs> ups you. and subscribe because I that is it. brave. I... Oh, this is bravery right here. It's okay. Tide pens are a man's best friend. <laughs> Honestly. I'm so okay. sorry. No, you're totally fine. If you it's want my me to fault. do a food challenge or anything, I am so down because I owe you one because I. <laughs> I almost ruined his jacket. She says she owes me one. Little does she know that last time we did a video together was on my channel where we had you eat a stick of butter, basically, so. Oh my god. Yeah, and cat food. <gasps> oh my I know, my you blocked gosh. it out of your memory because I it was totally that traumatic. I totally forgot. I, yeah, that I was probably great. should remind you of that, actually. <laughs> Matt, Pat, and Steph, they are amazing. You know what they did? They raised a ton of money for cancer, to fight cancer. Well, it was thanks to your help. It was so sweet. They included Mike and I and we came over and, and we were part of the live stream and you guys this raised over one million dollars. Yeah, we, we ended up at 1.3 million by the end of everything. Yeah, so that it was it was great. incredible. Go show him love. He's a wonderful human being doing wonderful things. God, you're sweet. And Come I on, had so much here. fun on that live stream, even though I was eating cat food. <laughs> I was we had a lot think, of fun. I was trying to think to myself, we're just playing Jenga. We gotta work <laughs> on Jenga skills a little bit. <laughs> and, and I really, and why I got so unlucky. You got Everyone really. else got pretty lucky, but I did not. So if you wanna go check out that live stream, I'm gonna put a link down below it is, and it links, is worth it. all of his links down below. Thank you so much, guys. Aww. Thanks for having me here. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys. See ya. And if you'd like to watch any other videos, you can click up here. Or alternatively, or up here. Up there, up there, up there. So up there. many links to choose there, from. There's this many. Two. And that's Four. a Over. lot. There. <laughs> oh, <my laughs> <gosh>. <laughs> and I have to.
Cheetos and it's in your eye now. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah, totally fine. <laughs>